garlic. Garlic is one popular spice. It is the root crop that is dubbed as the stinking rose. That would be garlic. The electric is off. Nonsense. So early in the day. <sighs> Just taking a break, I studied about 70 Portuguese words, but it's more words with objects so that I can picture those objects in my mind as Portuguese words, if that makes sense. My brain is a bit fried. Trying to do each day, learn Portuguese words, Portuguese phrases, and then obviously change that to Portuguese nouns, verbs, and adjectives to learn Portuguese. And then advance that and then talk, have conversations in Portuguese, understand the music, the culture. Yeah, but my brain is fried at the moment. And you might be asking, why am I? I do I want to be learning Portuguese? Well, I take an interest in Portuguese, in Brazilian Portuguese specifically, because I like capoeira. I'm a caparista. I haven't been training for a while because of traveling to the academy, to the gym. Uh, it's a bit of a uh, travel from Grassy Park all the way to town and it starts at 8 and which is not bad but I mean if you <laughs> like me don't have a license yet it's a bit of a struggle and then public transport I like public transport traveling late in, to town is it's a bit dodge so I'm busy training at home my calves are a bit sore from Saturday's training Garlic Garlic is one popular spice it is a root crop that is dubbed as the stinking rose. That would be garlic. The crushing garlic with your fist against the blade of a knife, or with the use of a garlic knife, for example, strengthens its flavor. Garlic. 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 So I'm going to do this room tour and a test tour. I keep my room relatively clean and try to sweep it or clean it every second week or maybe once or twice in a week. Yeah. So, shoes, Portuguese word for shoes, I think is sapato, the bed, cama, cama. I have my shirts, I like a good shirt with a pattern on, this I got by Mr. Price. So this shirt I got from a friend, Alex, and this also Mr. Price. My machine, Maxis machine. This helps you with because you're basically pulling up your own body weight, so you can kind of get defined. Here's my capoeira pants or my abada. Here's my belt or kodao, my green kodao. I forgot the name for green in Portuguese. Got second hand golf sticks, golf clubs. Oh, that's also second hand. Uh, here's my box with my supplies, paint and paper, and then there's also like rubbish in there for recycling, not for the fashion of it, but because I'm trying to keep the earth clean, you know. And here in my windowsill, trying to grow green peppers, but it's not germinating, the ones outside are germinating. Uh, my watercolor brushes. Um, not the best quality, it's very cheap because like the ears fall off but that's okay if you're starting out, which I am and the water bottle too yeah, let's redo that and then we got my haul um, my hat collection, I love hats when I had dreadlocks, I couldn't wear hats so I kind of missed that but now that I have no dreadlocks I'm kind of missing my dreadlocks the nice maroon sun hat we got the brown bowler hat, got the black bowler hat, and we got the peaker. So here um, is my wall of pictures or sh small photographs, doesn't really have a name. I like the idea of the Polaroid look, and I don't have a Polaroid camera, so I kind of printed it out and have a kind of a border. Some of the pictures that I printed out and put on my wall, I think we have this tendency as millennials or so next gen. 
to just store the stuff on the phone or the PC and you never ever actually get to look at it again whereas all the generations they have photo albums and you can go through the memories so these are the different pictures like myself and my cousin the first day of campus or the first week of campus Mestre Coruja, a capoeira Capoeira Mestre, not my Mestre but he came for the Batizado a capoeira group at the time still capoeira group Contra Mestre Motasa, yeah we got a picture, I got this off their Facebook um, Contra Mestre Motasa and Mestre Espino uh, Mestre Espiro, there's my dog Lola my dog blue also inspiration for the instagram youtube name but not exactly there's a family picture and Riesenberg beat my two sisters myself looking all yippee hipster mom and dad family this was a uh, series exit with a uh, four jets myself and kieran at this at this rock at Musenberg beach this was us back in the 90s early 90s at Musenberg beach my capoeira group yeah and then a self portrait yeah that is my room nothing special nothing fancy i used to have pictures all over my room but then it became too much of an over stimulus i'm trying to get to more of a minimalist type of thing not exactly but just have considered objects in my room yeah and so Continue with the room tour. Got a typewriter. Still need to figure out how to replace the ribbon with the ink. If anybody knows how to do that, uh, please leave a comment. <laughs> and then my walls are just painted white. You know, in Portuguese, the same burro. Then I have this. I love this. My light bulb. Inner light bulb. They say the light bulb was invented by Thomas Edison, but I just think he rediscovered it. Um, this I bought by Mr. Price home. I'm going to the table. The laptop, you know, the standard. Here we got my abalone shell or perla moon shell, normal stone. Well, I normally burn the incense or frankincense on there because I like the smell of it. It gives me that nostalgia of my old, old church, Anglican church, when they burn the, the frankincense. Still need to find out the reason. Printer for scanning in images and then the redrawing them or painting them for Illustrator. USB cable, pencil bag. A New Testament and Psalms. This is really good because then you can go, like for instance, you can get quick references like Face in Death, Failure Comes, Faith is Weak, and you can get reference scriptures with that. And then I have my regular Bible, international version. And then I got my journal with this image is drawn. From this image, we from this image over here, and then I have my flashcards, my Portuguese flashcards, porta, like door, cama, bed, etc., etc. Then I have my my shades. Um, I like also collecting shades. This is probably my fourth pair, but at the moment I only have this pair because I can't find the others. And then I have my. Animate your survival kit. This thing is really helpful to get the, the principles and motion and weight of your animation. Um, I need to relearn a few things because I'm relying too much on the PC. And then I got my uh, smartwatch currently charging. I use this for the pedometer that it has and it tells you your steps. I'm not really fast. If I don't remember the steps or improve on the amount of steps I took in a day, I just like the idea that you can actually monitor that. And then there's a sleep monitor as well. Then we have my drawer and I have my watercolor set by Koki. My CV here. Need to job hunt again. Thank you for watching my channel, uh, Stuff in Blue. You will see more of the stuff that interests me, but now that was my room slash desk tour. So I studied some of my Portuguese words or my flashcards. So I'll do vlogs about the things that interest me, spaces, places, stories, gardening, capoeira, training, animation, maybe animation reviews, who knows. I'm just the things that interest me. So yeah, stay tuned. Thanks for watching and like, 
subscribe, share, follow, stuff and do. Thank you. Garlic. Garlic is one popular spice. It is the root crop that is dubbed as the stinking rose. That would be garlic.